What up guys? I just found out that our beamers know the way that uh, we are driving. What that means is that uh, the car knows and uh, especially the gear uh, shifter indicator knows when you want to drive fast and when you are driving on uh, economy mode. So because we don't have here the Eco Pro button as a new models have, we are left with the shift indicator here to let us know how to drive in Eco Pro mode or in uh, fuel economy savings or if you like to drive a little bit faster and just uh, be on the track or um, in a high speed lane you'll see that the gear indicator will change the indication status conformly to your driving style so yeah let's begin and uh, i will explain to you what that means Okay, so watch carefully as I slowly accelerate how my uh, gear indicator works. So now I'm approaching 2000 RPMs and uh, it will tell me to shift in the next gear. As you can see, it's a pattern. So when you drive slowly and you drive under 2000 RPMs, you'll make your best economy that you can uh, get with your car. So for that, when you drive really slow, not really slow, but when you drive normally in town, your shift indicator will tell you to change uh, gear under 2000 RPMs. Okay, as you can see now. So in a few moments, we'll uh, gonna try to, to get a little bit of speed. And as you can see here, I'm changing under 2000 RPMs, but if I'll go now into third gear, and keep it on the 2000 RPMs bar, you can see that when my needle touches 2000, it shows for under 2000, it shows nothing. So again, I'm gonna floor it, and now shift into fourth. Now I'm in fourth gear, 1060, 1600, sorry, RPMs, and I'm going, I think, 70 miles so. Okay, now I'm gonna show you that the car will know what I want to do. And uh, in this case, that I will like to go a little bit faster and uh, try to match my shift indications according to my driving uh, habit. So, uh, let's test this out. I'm in third gear, approaching 2000 RPMs, and I'm gonna floor it. Watch carefully. It will show nothing. Now it shows when I'm over 3,000 3, uh, RPMs. Now I'm flooring it. And now in fifth gear, I'm over 2,000 RPMs and nothing shows. Did you see? So the car knows that I want to go fast. Okay, let's do that again. Let us slow down. And then I'm going now I'm second second gear and I'm flooring it. Third gear. Fourth gear. And now if I keep on flooring it. changing gears you have to keep your, your car's torque to the desired rpm that uh, your engine uh, likes so we have here 100 kilowatts of power so we have 143 horse brake power in my car to drive as quick as i can be and not lose power that means i have to change gears at uh, 3000 and something rpms that is the peak torque that I am allowed to to change uh, to change gear, so that I I don't lose any uh, any power from there. Again, let's see the part of uh, eco driving. 
So now I'm in second gear and I'm approaching 2000 RPMs. And you see there it shows me to change gear. Now I'm in third gear and approaching 2000 RPMs. And again it tells me to switch in fourth. So yeah, that's really simple. That is the way to drive in Eco Pro mode on a E90. And hope this video helps. If so, leave a thumbs up and uh, why not subscribe for new videos?